In this video, let's see another ITJ numerical problem based on the matrices chapter which was asked in the year 2003 for 2 marks. It is a subjective problem that means it had no options and you had to solve and write the answer. So that is what we will be doing, we will be solving and writing the answer. Let's read the question. If matrix A is equal to this matrix which means it is a 3 by 3 matrix which has 3 rows, 3 columns where ABC are real positive numbers and given to me is ABC is equal to 1 and AA transpose is equal to I. Two conditions are given to me. Find the value of, you have to find the value of AQ plus BQ plus CQ. Now if you need such kind of value, you basically need to know whether any formula is there, mathematical formula which has these terms. Yes, it is AQ plus BQ plus CQ minus 3ABC formula. So, we will be writing that formula but first let us use the given conditions. The given conditions are ABC is equal to 1 and AA transpose is equal to I. Let us use AA transpose is equal to I. I will be writing the heading as solution and let us start with the solution. AA transpose is equal to i means what it means that you have to multiply that means it is based on the product of matrices a and a transpose what is a it is a b c b c a c a b what is a transpose a transpose is converting the rows to columns columns to rows that means interchange so it is a b c that means first row became first column second row became second column third row became third column is equal to i. i is what? Identity matrix 1 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 1. Now first row first column, first row first column, first row second column and so on we have to move you know that. So it is a into a which is a square plus b square plus c square as the first row first column element then AB plus BC plus CA. So it is AB plus BC plus CA and then we have AC plus BA plus CB. So it is AC which is CA. So AC plus BA plus last CB. So it is BC. So basically it is AB plus BC plus CA only right. Here it is b square plus c square plus a square again it means it is a square plus b square plus c square only right because 2 plus 3 is equal to 3 plus 2 as I always say. Now b into b, c into c, a into a. So this means this term has to come in between. It is the diagonal term. First you have to do second row first column. So it is b into b, c into c, a into a that means b square plus c square plus a square here. Second row first column is what? b a plus b c plus a c. You see always what will happen is you do not need to solve it. You will have a cyclic order which is a b plus b c plus c a in the first place and you know in the third place and so on. So do not solve it here. Similarly you can have the same thing a b plus b c plus c a only. This means you had saving time basically right. So it is CA plus CB and all again the last will give me the diagonal ones so it is A square plus B square plus C square here the things do not change it is AB plus BC plus CA and here also it is the same AB plus BC plus CA this you can enclose in a big bar that means a matrix form and it is equal to 1000010001 now most of you might have understood what are we going to do? We are going to compare. Comparison. Comparison means AB plus BC plus CA is equal to 0 and A square plus B square plus C square is equal to 1. These two equations we have got. So let us write them that we have got AB plus BC plus CA equal to 0. This we will be using and we will be using A square plus B square plus C square is equal to 1. Nobody can stop us using these equations because these will be needed. Right? So this is done. What about the rest? The rest is ABC is equal to 1. We can even use that ABC is equal to 1 because that will be of much importance. So I write ABC is equal to 1. 
Now my task is to compute what? It is to compute a cube plus b cube plus c cube. So let's write down the formula and then we'll be using that. So it is a cube plus b cube plus c cube minus 3abc is equal to what? Is equal to a plus b plus c multiply, most of you might remember this formula, a square plus b square plus c square minus ab minus bc minus ca. Right? This is the formula as whole. Now, what is a plus b plus c? We don't know. What is a square plus b square plus c square? This is the value given to me, that is 1. What is minus common if then ab plus bc plus ca? ab plus bc plus ca is 0. So, you know, we have some values, we don't have some. Let's see what we have and how the question changes. So, it is a cube plus b cube plus c cube minus 3abc, that means 3 multiply abc, abc is 1, so 3 ones are is 3, a plus b plus c, we don't know, let's write it as it is, a square plus b square plus c square is 1, so it is 1 minus, take common minus sign, it is ab plus bc plus ca, what is ab plus bc plus ca, it is 0, so 1 minus 0. Now 1 minus 0 you all know is 1, 1 multiplied by any factor is that factor itself. So it is a cube plus b cube plus c cube is equal to a plus b plus c plus 3. What are we supposed to find? We are supposed to find a cube plus b cube plus c cube. But not in the form of a, b, c, in the form of a number. So let's make it in a box and think of another formula which uses a cube plus b cube plus c cube and or a plus b plus c. And you must note that this formula is a bit lengthy one. So there are tricks to learn it. I hope you remember it. Now, what is the formula involving a plus b plus c and some squares? The formula is none other than a plus b plus c whole square. What is the formula? I just write the formula here that is star. One formula more was there, I write this star. So it is a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca. So ab plus bc plus ca. Now, what is a square plus b square plus c square? a square plus b square plus c square is 1. So it is 1 plus 2 multiply ab plus bc plus ca. 2 multiply 0 is 0. So 1 plus 0 which is 1. That means what? That means a plus b plus c whole square is equal to the value. What is the value? It is 1. If whole square is equal to 1, you take the square root, you have 1 only. So a plus b plus c is 1. Now why have we computed this value? Just to put it here. You needed this value here. This is equation number 1, this is equation number 2. So my equation number 2, when put in equation number 1 becomes what? It becomes 1 plus 3. And so put 2 in 1, I have the final answer a cube plus b cube plus c cube. a cube plus b cube plus c cube is equal to what? It is equal to a plus b plus c which is 1 plus 3 which is 4. So basically, the answer to this ITJ problem which was asked in the year 2003 for 2 marks is 4.